hello and welcome back to Plans on Planning. Here we are in my social planner and we are going to get straight down to business. Let's talk about this washi that I have. I wanted to go floral and then I found this. It has some cute little sayings on it so I thought that would be nice. And then I have this as my washi to do my weeks which I thought is really cute because it breaks up the floral patterns and whatnot. So that definitely, definitely works for me. So let's get these pages out. Oops. Push this to the side. And let's make a beautiful. So the first thing we need to do is get rid of this month of. Bam. Um, let's get rid of this top line just in case. I'm not sure what the washi is going to work like. So I'd rather be safe than sorry. And then I want to get rid of this stuff as well because I'm going to put some washi in this area. And I'm just patting it down to make sure that everything is sticking properly. So, this is going to go across the top. This is going to go here, 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 so on and so forth. And this one is going to go right in here. And I think it's going to be cute. So, let's get started. And I'm just going to go over the side just a tad. Because, like I said, it just makes it so much easier on myself. Then having to like line it up and all that stuff. Bam. And oh gosh. And then the other side. Bam. Alright, so we're good on that. Now I'm going to do my border washi, if I could find the beginning of it, oh, wait, was that it? No, that wasn't it. Man, this thing is difficult to find. Oh, here it is. And I'm just going right under my days. Uh-oh. This one seems to be a little tough, so I'm just going to get on my scissors and slice away just like that. And then I'm going to go across the bottom just as simple and easy. And now I'm gonna put this other color in the middle. Or oh, this other washi, sorry. Which it semi fits the whole space. That's why I put the washi in first, the smaller washi in first. So this way, if needed, I can go ahead and put it right on top. And bam, there we go. And I'm breaking it right at the border. Bam, oops. I'll just cut that piece. Bam. Works out perfectly. And I'm just gonna cut the excess off the sides. Now I didn't take it all the way across because I'm gonna have this thinner washi go all the way up the side and I want everything to still work together. So here we are. Alrighty. Now let's go with my small washi. So it does look really cute. 
All right, so we're gonna use the smaller washi to frame out our weeks. Like I said, we're just using the scissor just to make it so much easier because I guess the foiling from the polka dots, the rose gold polka dots, makes it a little difficult to tear on its own. So, instead of fighting to tear it and then wind up stretching out the washi, I just use my scissors like a straight edge or a scalpel or whatever you want to call it, and I cut it. It just makes it so much easier, so much better, so much quicker. Because when you fight the washi and you tear it, what actually happens is you start to like bend it out of shape. So if you're ever wondering why your lines aren't straight anymore and they kind of like sag a little bit, um, that's why. That's exactly where it's from. Now I'm going to use this and I'm putting it just over the black line which I'm using the end of the page as my guide so it winds up being just on the black line actually bam I'm not going the wrong way whoop whoop alright and I'm going to go right over the side right up the side sorry And for that, I'm going to use the actual edge of the calendar as my guide. Bam. There we go. And I'm bringing it right up to the top of the washi I already have there. And we're... That is a wonderful start. I really like that. And now we're on to the other side of the page. So I'm going to go right across the top under my days. go and right across the bottom Bam. and then I'm going to use the line right going down it as my guide Now, I'm not scratching the line in my table, so I'm going to go just above the table. Actually, I could have just cut it, truthfully. But, <laughs> all right, so there we go. There's that. So, let's see our whole creation together. So, this is what we have to start off our month with. Pretty freaking awesome, if you ask me. I love, love, love the rose gold. So, the stickers that I'm using are from the three, the Happy Planner uh, Squaggle stickers. 
and they are super super freaking cute and the page that we're using is this page here so granted i know that in some parts of the world summer is over but where i'm from down here in little florida summer is still going and summer goes you know kind of as long as we want it to go to be honest but it's still super hot down here and we are still doing our thing and having the best of time while we're doing it so i'm going to continue to celebrate the summer and the summer months by adding these wonderful and super cute like beachy um stickers yeah Um, let's put this right here. Oops, 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 oops. Didn't realize it was so long, but I'm feeling like I'm gonna put this like right here though. Yeah, I like that a little better. I like this one over here. Oh yeah. We're gonna put something down here. Let's put this little lady up here, playing with this little lady down here. And then I got this wonderful girl. I'm gonna put her over here. Yeah. And then I definitely wanna add like a squaggles. There we go. I mean, I'm not finished, but these are the basics. I feel like. Got these super cute little flip flops, and not to mention these are adorb sandals. Oh, I think it's coming along so cute. Oh, so close, so close, so close, so close. My fave type of sunglasses are cat eye sunglasses. I totally, totally love them. And a seashell. All right, so there we go. There we have it. This is what we are working with for the month of September in my social planner. I'm doing something very, very different when it comes to my social planner and I am adding a lot more flair going on and I actually think I like it. 
So, I thank you guys ever so much for joining me here on Plans on Planning. Um, don't forget to leave a comment. If you feel more comfortable um, sending an email, go right ahead and send the email. Just add any questions or anything like that you want, things you love, things you hated, things you just want to know more about. I'm totally here for it all. Um, also, if you wouldn't mind go right ahead and follow me on social media that would definitely like be awesome and then once you do just go right ahead and slide in my dms and let me know like hey i saw your video this that and the third whatever you want to talk about we can go ahead and talk about um but in the meantime in between time i will see you later days bye